Hey guys, it's August 1st and it's my last full day in Amman. And that makes me really, really sad. See what I did there? Trying to figure out my emotions beforehand because it's still only June here. Amazingness. See, I can tell the future. I can tell that I'm not going to want to leave. Actually, I can't tell, but I'm pretty sure that's what's going to happen. I'm so excited. I can't, I, have, I haven't even left yet when I'm filming this, but the day you're watching this is my last day there. That's a weird disconnect to think about. So tomorrow I get on a plane and fly back to DC. Actually, I get on a plane and fly to Germany and then DC, and then I chill in DC until the 4th, and then on the 4th I actually fly home. Yeah, that's weird to think about, because then it goes back to like real life after that, because then that's a Thursday, and then Friday I'm at home, and then I have a weekend, like a normal weekend, like a normal summer weekend that I've had like one of so far this summer, not counting them on. And then the next week I start band camp, and so I'm at school every day. And then I think I have a couple days, and then school school starts. Ah! I haven't even done my summer reading yet. Like, I, I know for a fact that when I, that, that'll still be true by the time you see this. Because I'm not going to do it in the three days or four days or however many left I have before I actually leave for Amman. And since you're watching this when I'm in Amman, you know that I'm not going to be doing American summer reading on top of everything in Amman. So I'll be doing it, oh, that one weekend? It's going to be a homework weekend. Great. Awesome. Yeah, so next week I'm going to have a video that's actually like a video video from me after I get home So I have lots of stories to tell and everything So if you have any questions what I'm on or Jordan or anything you'd like to hear about Please tell me in the comments because I can pretty much talk about whatever because I'm going to be talking about Jordan I'm tempted to do a thoughts from places depending on how much video I end up with So if you tell me what you'd want to hear about that'd be fantastic. I'm sorry. This is a really horrible video I filmed eight videos today. This is the eighth one I've run out of current events topics to talk about. I think I've talked about trees like way too much. I've done an entire video on trees. Do you know how bad that is? Trees. <laughs> Actually, that wasn't that bad of a video. Just what did you make a video on today? Trees. I know what we should talk about today. Let's talk about time. That's a deep topic we could discuss. Time. What do you think about time? Are you scared of time? Do you like time? Do you think you're wasting your time? What do you do to waste time? Do you ever find yourself just waiting around? What do you do when you're waiting? Is time a good thing? Is time a bad thing? Would you rather keep really strict time or not look at time at all? Do you think being efficient is a good thing or do you think something else is more important? I'm not sure. These are all very personal questions. I don't know if you want to answer those. I don't know if I can answer all those. Time is interesting. Relativity is interesting too. Relativity is fascinating. Relativity. Oh my gosh. It's especially strange when I've been living in a country that's nine hours in the future. My time in Jordan is over. It's my last day there. That makes me really sad. Next week, I'll definitely give you guys like an actual update on how Jordan was. Actually, probably for the next couple weeks, I'll be giving you updates on how Jordan was because I'm sure I'll have lots to talk about. I've been filming all these in advance and it's a really weird sensation to be filming yourself to be broadcasted at a weekly interval when you're not actually going to be there. I don't know, it's just a weird experience to be like talking to the camera, like people are going to see this on August 1st. On August 1st, I will have not been on YouTube for two months, but people are still going to see this on August 1st. And then for those two months that I won't have been on YouTube, people will have been watching me every Monday. That's just a weird thing to think about. Especially when I'm filming this so far in advance, it's weird to be thinking about the day I'd be coming home already. Because this is the last day, like August 1st would be the last day that I'd have in Jordan. So. I got my host family information yesterday, like speaking in my June 4th voice. I got it or like the beginning of June. Like I know so little about my host family. I know that there's a mom and a dad and I know their names and I know like the district of a mom they live in and I have no idea where it is though. All I know is that it means suburb of something and I don't even know what the something is or what, like what suburb qualifies to be because I know suburb around here is like two hours out of the city and I don't think that's what it means. And then I know their children's ages, but I don't even know like whether the kids are guys or girls or anything. And that's like now at the beginning of June. And I have a feeling by that last day in Amman where I don't want to leave, I like totally miss them. Like I'll be like leaving tomorrow on a plane to Germany and then to the US again. And I don't want to leave. I'm going to miss them so very much. I'm so... Ah, I'm getting all nostalgic even though I haven't even been there yet. This is so weird to be filming these videos in advance. Ah. So that's all. I'll talk to you guys about something actual and real. I guess time is real. This is real. Something more relevant to the rest of the world except for my nostalgia and time. I'll talk about that next week. I'll talk about Jordan next week. So, oh my god, it's August. I will actually see you next week. What fantasticness. Thanks. Bye. I'm coming home. I'm coming home. 
Tell the world I'm coming home On the plane from far away After so many days I miss my host family And everyone I got to see I'm coming home, coming home From Jordan I'm coming